Today we are reviewing the War Machine Hulkbuster. Alright, so we're going to start off with the first category right now. Minifigures. It comes with two minifigures. A War Machine with an Infinity War outfit. And an Ant-Man with an Infinity War outfit. The War Machine, you can open the helmet. And it has this face. And then you can take off the helmet. Sorry, I have to do this with one hand. And it's miserable. I also lost... Has this face. I also um, lost the back part. I took it apart and never put it back on. Because it would annoy the set. And, you know, I lost a hair piece. If it came with one. I don't remember. It's been a while. This is the Ant-Man. I think it looks pretty good, in my opinion. I mean, we've got this helmet, which is, well, I love it a lot. It's it's pretty good, in my opinion. And then when you go to head pieces, you have this face. Scott Lang is smiling. And this face, where he's surprised. Alright, starting on to the next category. Three, two, one. Sets. Okay, this is the set itself the, for the War Machine Hulkbuster. Looks pretty good, doesn't it? It's bulky and armored and everything, which is what I love. But unlike with the Hulkbuster, just the normal Infinity War Hulkbuster, its arms don't move. Like, legitimately. Bruh, look, look at this. It doesn't go down, it's, a, it's just a... It's just like a... Singular piece, like a, like a, what do you call that piece? Just like a, a bar? I'm going to call it a bar. Then you've got the stud shooters on each arm. Where did that part go? Where did that part go? i got to find it. Dang it, I didn't even know it was gone. Um, yeah, you've got the stud shooters, because, you know, we've got the stud shooter mini gun, which, if you turn the style at the back, it fires. I'll cover that later. Then you've got the flick fire missiles. Because you know, you can't be a Lego set without flick fire missiles. Alright, now we're moving on to features. Three, two, one. Alright, features. Hopefully you like the features category. So feature for features, you can turn this uh, dial back here to fire all the stud shooters in the stud shooter minigun. You can hit these on the stud shooters to fire the studs. You can flick the back of the flick, flick fire missiles. Or push the back of them and they fire. And if you want to put your minifig actually in the cockpit, you lift the head up. You move these bars out of the way. And then you pull this down. And I messed it up already. See, look. Yeah. And I hope you liked the set review for... The War Machine Hulk Buster, or whatever you want to call it, the War Buster. And goodbye. Why am I shaking the screen? I don't know.